what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix this issue if your model warfare is not launching or not starting properly so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue before we start on to the video i just want you guys to know let you guys know that that would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys you will support my work on youtube a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is gonna be to navigate to the taskbar right click it and open up your task manager once this, the task manager pops up just simply navigate to the top left corner click onto processes and uh, afterwards, just click one of those random processes, doesn't really matter which one. And uh, once you clicked it, just search for at Modern Warfare by just clicking M, search for Modern Warfare. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, just simply right click and end this task. Once you're finished, you should be able to end the task manager again. The next step is going to be to take your um, battle.net. Um, yeah, your battle.net shortcut or your modern warfare shortcut on your desktop and if you don't have it on your desktop just simply navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen and search for it and with the windows search function and once you found it just simply drag it right into your desktop so let's quickly come back you're gonna right click and navigate to the very one where it says properties once this one pops up just simply navigate to compatibility and copy my settings so enable run this program in compatibility mode 4 select windows 8 Disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this program as an administrator, hit apply and OK. Once you're finished, I would personally recommend you to restart your PC and once it is restarted, you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right on your shortcut. So what I want you to do next is going to be really simple, just double click it and launch your launcher or your game and launch the game over the launcher. Yeah guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that and I'm going to thank you for that. But I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you guys, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.